Now I'm ready to take some more data. I've got a fresh sheet of paper. I've got the slab in the middle of it, so there's more room to, to mark the angles. And I've even I've taken the slab and drawn the outline so that I can put this back in position, but also so that you know where the normals, uh, where, the, where the surfaces are, because you're going to measure from normal. And so we're all set here. Before we do this, though, I want to show you, let's bring up the side view. I want to show you something interesting about refraction. So, okay, here's the side view. Here's the pin. Let me point with the pencil. Here's the top of the pin looking over it. So you're looking directly at it. And here's the body of the pin. And we're looking straight on so you, they line up. But now, if I move, the, move off to the side, look what happens. The top of the pin is here, and the body, you can see, is here, and there's a disconnect because you're looking at the bottom, the body of the pin down here through the glass, and it's traveling one path, and then you're looking at the top, and it's traveling straight through the air. And those are two different paths. You may have seen this before. If you take a glass of water and stick a long spoon in it or a straw, and you'll see that it looks like the straw is like disconnected because the light coming from the straw through the water is traveling one path and the light from the straw up above is in a different path. So let's put these here. Remember, we're gonna line things up with, with uh, the light that goes through the glass. So I'll, put a, I'll take a second pin and I'll put it somewhere here and it's over here and I want to move this so that they line up. So I'll move my point of view. Remember, this, this would be your head moving side to side. And there. I've got it lined up so that, and you can check. I'm touching the pencil to the, to the pin one. I'm touching the pencil to pin two. And then I'll get the next pin and I'll move it back and forth until it's right in front of pins one and two. That's pin three. Oh, no, the block got moved. So watch out for that. Are we still, you know, I'll get that right in the block. The block is square and all three pins are lined up. And then pin four will come out in front of pin three. And I'll move it back and forth, back and forth until I get it right in front of pin three. All four pins are lined up now. You can verify that by moving your head to the side, one side. The other, you can see the pins, but when you're looking at them straight on, you're looking at the light. So that's another data point.